you want to turn them in such a way that it lines up. So all the holes line up so you can get at those holes. Almost there. There we go. So I'm good. All the holes are lined up. These push pin holes and all the plate holes line up. Two here, two here, two here. And my sprocket is holding those two discs. They're lined up right. Once I have them lined up right, and I'm happy with it, which I am, then I can take this off. You can use these to try to hold things in place if you want, these push pins. With the key here now, so you're going to have to compress this all down to put a retaining ring on. Hello? Hey Al, it's Kevin. How you doing? Yeah, I'm down here. All right, sounds good. No, I got a coffee. Thanks, Al. All right, see you, buddy. Bye. These are M6 bolts. And I put some washers on because it's a little bit too long. The short ones I have are too short. So what I'm doing is I'm squeezing these plates together. I'm squeezing those springs down. What I have exposed now is one retaining ring. Well, I got to get to the second one. See, the first retaining ring is here. That's right on top of the bearing. All the plates go between here. The next retaining ring is here. That's what we need to get to. Is this a uh, plate with the holes in it needs to line up. Got that. Then comes clutch sprocket. Lines up like that. This plate's going to need to line up. Only goes on one way, the holes have to line up as they do.
but you know what? My sword clip's on there wrong. It's covering a hole, so I'm going to have to tap it over, hopefully. Good. There we go. Primary chain on. All my holes line up. Push rods fit in. Now, before I put this circlip on, push it down and put the circlip on, I need to, uh, and then this finally goes on last. I need to get uh, the next step done, which is the uh, generator side. All right. So, on the uh, right half, the, I don't know if you can see this. The gear selector rod will fit in, and then the um, starter shaft will go in with the spring on this side of the housing. The stack that's together will go small gear down until it fits on. So on the uh, starter lever. There's a spacer ring. It's a thin washer that goes on. And 